Hey everybody, Big D here, and I am about to start my Game of Thrones uh, walkthrough, playthrough, whatever you want to call it, man. Now, I may not be doing commentary throughout the whole thing because it's a telltale game, man, and it's all about story, it's all about the character, and I don't want to interrupt on that. Uh, I'll do other games where I'll talk, you know, where, like, Call of Duty and all that, like, regular story stuff like that, but this is all about the story, man, like, full-on... It's all about the story, man, so just end up watching it. I hope all of you enjoy it. I'm also doing Tales from the Borderlands, which is another Telltale game, so check that out. Make sure to share this video, guys, and it's Game of Thrones, baby. Six episodes, so I'll be doing all episodes also for the Borderlands also. Thank you so much for joining me. Hit that like button, comment down below, tell me what you guys think, and uh, I'll try to upload as much as I can, guys. Thanks so much. Hope all of you enjoy. Winter is coming. The trout, the trout, the trout in the towers, the wolves got the fish and they all ran away. The trout he fucked oh, off and out of the house and fallen in love with me. Another wall to pray. Two weddings, two beddings brought on by the eddings, and I am in cups for me. Two weddings, two beddings brought on by the eddings, and all is happily. All is happily. The great Jamie Lannister. Kingslayer, Oathbreaker, brought to his knees by the men of the North. And set free by the women. You'd think he'd done it himself the way he tells it. Old Forrester's sword won't clean itself, you know. Make sure it's spotless this time. Old Forrester won't be happy with blood and brains all over it. Go on, it's only blood. Now that is a proper sword. I'll have one like it myself someday. You? You'll never have a sword like that. I say that as a friend. And if we're being honest, you are just a squire. I will. You'll see. Of course, your lordship. After you take your rightful place on the Iron Throne. I had a hand in it, you know. <laughs> a hand in what? Capturing him. He was nowhere near the Kingslayer at the Whispering Wood. He was so drunk, he barely made it out of his tent. Next, he'll tell us he caught Tyrion, too. <laughs> you think he's lying? No one never lets the truth stand in the way of a good story. You captured the Kingslayer? Aye. Well, I had a hand in it. Aye. A hand round his ankle as ten others took him down. <laughs> See? What did I tell you? I brought him to his knees. Lord Forrester. But not before he dragged you halfway across the battlefield on your face. You're questioning <laughs> Norrin's honor. I'm questioning Norrin's story, which grows more far-fetched every time he tells it. Get your liege lord some wine. Go on. It's your job. Right, thanks. You're welcome. Thank you, Garrett. I'll do it. Norrin's family has faithfully served House Forrester for centuries. His honor is beyond reproach, and House Tully is forever in his debt. You've never seen a field plowed so well as the day the Kingslayer dragged poor Norrin across the battlefield. <laughs> Fetch your cup. 
Tonight we celebrate. <laughs> to Rob Stark, the king in the north! The, the king, king in the north! Tomorrow, we march on Casterly Rock, and House Forrester has been given the greatest honor to lead the young wolf's army and ride as the vanguard! The gods have favored us. Onward! To Castle Rock! Aye! Death to the Lannisters! Aye! The North remembers! Aye! Got it. Yes, my lord? I need you to keep an eye out for Roderick. As his father, I could not be more proud of the man he's become. On a night like this, Men find false courage at the bottom of their cups. I'd rather he were here. Yes, my lord. There's also the question of what's to be done with you. It's been on my mind for a while now. Something must be done. With me, my lord? You've served House Forrester well for several years now, but I can't expect you to squire forever. How shall I reward your loyalty? What can I offer you? Serve me well. Let me fight for you, my lord. You've more than proven your ability on the battlefield. No man would question that. There were those who had their doubts when your uncle put forth your name as my squire. But you've erased those doubts entirely. It would be an honor to see you riding by Roderick's side in the vanguard tomorrow. Not as a squire, but as the equal of any man who serves House Forrester. It's well deserved, Garrett. Your hard work has paid off. Thank you, my lord. I promise. I won't let you down. That I don't doubt. But for now, keep this between us. We're celebrating tonight. I wouldn't want the other squires to feel discouraged. Yes, my lord. Now go, and find Roderick if you can. I will, my lord. Thank you. Bloody hell. Empty. Squire! Fetch us more wine! Can you give me a hand? Come on. Can I get up to you? Do it yourself. I've been a squire longer than you, which means I outrank you. So? He told you, not me. Go with Bowen. Fetch more wine, scrub my armor, clean my boots. It's my luck to end up with Norin while you serve the Lord. Let him fetch his own wine for once. He's a drunk, a liar, and an arrogant prick. It's your job to do the work and stop complaining. You try Squire in for Norin and see how much you like it. See, that's where you're lucky. Low expectations. If I'd grown up covered in big shit, shovel and slop, well, maybe I'd think saddling his horse was the greatest honor in the Seven Kingdoms. I suppose this beats pig farming. Who doesn't love bacon? Ah, pig farmers. <laughs> All I'm saying is, at this rate we'll never be more than this, which is nothing. The lowest of the low. For all I know, we could be squires for life. All in wine around a fucking wedding. What a waste of fucking time. I'm sick of listening to your wine. With that attitude, you'll never be more than this. Easy for you to say. Maybe if my uncle were Castle, then I'd feel different. Who my uncle is has nothing to do with it. How much further? Well, that's right over there. Take your time. You lot have drunk your share. Good thing, Lord Walders. In a generous mood. Fucking phrase. Nice. <sighs> nice night for a wedding. Not often he finds a willing husband for one of his daughters. Don't expect me to carry it for you, Sir Garrett. What's wrong?
just gotten into you. You're acting rather odd. We need to get back. Now. They're fine. They can wait. No, you don't understand. We need to go. And take the fucking flagon already. What's wrong with him? Something the matter? Owen, we have to go. You go if you're in such a rush. We have to warn the others. Good luck. Ah! Oh. My lord. Where's my squire? You didn't leave him, did you? What happened to him? Speak up, boy. I, I had to leave him. I had no other choice. Find a weapon, quickly! Still time. Seven hells. Well, now what do we do? If we run, they'll hunt us down like dogs. If we stay, they'll slaughter us like the others. Iron Wrath, 
where it belongs. There's no time to waste. I'll be damned if I let it fall into the hearts of those traitors. What the phrase you have to go. You're welcome to the fucking torch. I will do as you command, my lord. You have served me well. I know I can count on you. Tell your uncle. <laughs> Tell him. The North Grove must never be lost. Tell no one but him. Do you understand? You must swear. Tell only your uncle Duncan. The future of the house may depend on it. Tell only the Castellan. Hey, it's those foresters. Now go. On your honor, you must do this for your house. Go! Kill those <laughs> fucking foresters! <laughs> 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 We love the world.